Good morning, everybody. I am walking to work, and I decided to tell y'all a story um, that this walk reminded me of. Sorry if the video is a little shaky because I don't have a selfie stick. Uh, guys, this is all weird. Just gonna try to be as balanced as possible. Anywho, so when I was in college, um, I had this friend named Diana, right? And I remember um, we <laughs> we went to school. I'm near a Walmart, right? And it's my freshman year. And I know I'd driven to the Walmart before. It wasn't that long of a drive um, with my mom. Um, and so one day, me and my roommate, Emily, were doing what most girls do in college, planning her wedding, of course. Um, <laughs> so we're looking at David's bridal. This is freshman year, okay? And we're planning my roommate's wedding. She wasn't engaged. Um, <laughs> Yeah, so Diana busts into the room and she said, oh, hell no. Uh-uh, y'all got to get out of this room. Y'all been in this room for too long. Let's go. We're like, where are we going? She's like, let's go to Walmart. I'm like, don't nobody here drive. And she was like, well, nobody had a car. Um, she's like, we can walk. I was like, you said what now? She said, yeah, it's not that far. It's like down the street. So with my limited memory, I'm like, for sure. It's not that far. Been there with my mom's. Cool. We put on our shoes and we start walking. About 20 minutes into the walk, I was like, hey girl, where's um, where's Walmart? <laughs> oh, Jesus. And she's like, oh, it's, it's not too far. Let's just keep going. About 40 minutes into the walk, I'm like, hey friend, where's Walmart? So at this point, we are tired. Um, we are hungry because we did not have dinner. Um, and, and we're looking at her like, hey, sister friend, if, if Walmart don't show up anytime soon, we're going to have problems. So we, <laughs> we turned into this plaza. Was it Domino's that was there? I think it was a Domino's. And we grabbed a pizza and we kept walking. About an hour and 15 minutes later, we arrive at Walmart. Okay. It was an hour and 15 minute walk. It's about almost four miles to Walmart. And this girl said it was down the street. I should have known something was up because she was from Atlanta. Mm-hmm. So down the street, I guess means something a little different in Atlanta. Anywho, so we get to Walmart after walking about four miles. And guess what? Walmart was closed, y'all. It closed at nine. It was about 9.30 when we got there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, uh, what had happened was, um, it started raining. What fun. And we sat, on, <laughs> we sat on a bench outside of a closed Walmart under the rain, eating a box of Domino's pizza. And this was the time before, let me try to cross the street real quick. This was a time before Ubers, so guess who couldn't get home without walking us? So we finished walking four miles to Walmart and then had to walk four miles back to school at night in the rain. Moral of the story is if somebody's from Atlanta, don't trust them when they say down the street. Okay. <laughs> um, it was a pretty interesting walk back to you. There's some people in a car harassing us. Uh, there was this drunk guy hitting on my roommate. Hilarious. Um, I wonder if they remember this. Y'all remember this? Emily and Diana, if you're watching this, do y'all remember this? Yeah, needless to say, I lost about 73 pounds that day. Um, <laughs> and my, my feet hurt for a couple of days after walking about eight miles in a day. Yes, that is our story on this morning. Y'all have a blessed and prosperous day. May the Lord be with you. And don't trust your friend when they say it's down the street. Use your GPS and figure it out, okay? Until I see y'all again, you have a duty to shine your light in this world. So go on and light up the world. Bye. Light up the world. Light up the world. One syllable at a time. Light up the woods, light up the woods. One video at a time. Light up the woods.